We purchased this passenger side view mirror pre-primed. I'm here again with my friend DLB who is spray painting it down with an automotive combo of paint and clear coat. We'll let it dry while addressing the old one. God, that lays out nice, doesn't it? Let's begin by loosening these two Phillips head screws. Then using a Torx T30, remove the two in the door handle. Now these aren't absolutely necessary, but they help get a better view of the Phillips screw behind the door's wedge piece. With that out, we'll grab our 10 millimeter socket and remove the retaining flange nuts. And the electrical harness to allow for removal of that old side view mirror. Prior to painting, we taped the mirror and wire harness, but as you can see, some still got through. Peel the coating to reveal its sticky side and adhere that to the new mirror. Place the weather stripping in its grooves before threading the electrical. We'll go ahead and hand tighten these flange nuts for testing. With our first try, we got no power windows. It does not. Thinking back to the oversprayed paint, we applied and brushed in some 5% deoxid to both the connector and the harness. And this time, it worked! That's all I need! <laughs> Deoxid to the rescue, baby! We can finally put it all back together. Thank you for checking out my video. Feel free to drop me comments or questions. And of course, like and subscribe if you enjoyed this. We'll see you next week.